Another day, to learn. Learn the basics of chess in 10 minutes. Hello and welcome to this beginner's guide to chess. Chess is a game that has been around for over a thousand years and is played all over the world. It's a game of strategy, planning, and execution. In this video, we'll cover the basics of the game so that you can start playing chess right away. Part 1. Setting up the board The chessboard consists of 64 squares arranged in an 8x8 grid. Each player has 16 pieces, 1 king, 1 queen, 2 rooks, 2 knights, 2 bishops, and 8 pawns. The pieces are placed on the board in a specific way at the beginning of the game. The rooks go in the corners, followed by the knights, then the bishops, with the queen on her own color, and the king on the remaining square of the queen's color. The pawns are placed in front of the other pieces. Part 2. The movement of pieces. Each piece moves in a specific way. The king can move one square in any direction. The queen can move diagonally, horizontally, or vertically any number of squares. The rooks can move horizontally or vertically any number of squares. The bishops can move diagonally any number of squares. The knights move in an L shape, two squares in one direction and then one square perpendicular to that. The pawns move forward one square, but on their first move, they can move two squares forward. They capture diagonally. Part 3. Objective of the game. The objective of the game is to checkmate the opponent's king. This means that the opponent's king is under attack, in check, and cannot move to a safe square on the next move. The game ends when one player achieves checkmate, or when the players agree to a draw, or when time runs out. Part 4. Special Moves There are a few special moves in chess that you need to know. The first is called Castling, which is a move that allows the king and one of the rooks to switch places. This move is used to protect the king and activate the rook. Another special move is called on passant, which is a capture made by a pawn that has advanced two squares from its starting position and is threatened by an opposing pawn on an adjacent file. Finally, there is the promotion of a pawn, where a pawn that reaches the other side of the board can be replaced by a queen, rook, bishop, or knight. Conclusion That's it for this beginner's guide to chess. We hope that you now have a good understanding of the basics of the game. The best way to learn is to practice, so grab a friend or find an online game and start playing. Remember to have fun and keep learning. Thanks for watching.